The Rich Thomas Weather Network is brought to you by these fine sponsors. Good day from the Blue Water Weather Center on this Monday, April the 18th. I hope you're having a good day so far. The weather's been great so far after a uh, beautiful weekend. We're going to uh, update you on exactly what's going on here as far as uh, the current conditions. This is our midday now cast, plus a little update on the forecast as well. We'll get you up to date on that and we'll uh, take a look ahead. I want to remind you about the website richthomasweathernetwork.com. If you haven't checked it out yet, it's a great place to uh, to go for weather information because you get all of the videos, you get all of the live streaming whenever there's any severe weather, you get all the tweets, all the Facebook posts, uh, plus other great stuff including radar, uh, you'll get the hour by hour forecast and your extended forecast. It's all one stop shopping and it's at Rich Thomas Weather Network Dot com. Now, you want to talk some weather? Let's do that. Let's go to the weather computer here. And we're looking at a dry day, even though you see a couple of bloops on the radar. That is nothing. Uh, that's actually um, uh, just where the radar lo is located. You see you see some around Carville, uh, where the East Alabama radar is located. You also see some uh, up there around Alabaster, uh, where uh, the... Uh, the uh, uh, Birmingham radar is located but uh, otherwise we're looking at visible satellite and we're seeing a nice day the winds are lighter than they have been and just a few high thin wispy cirrus clouds what about temperatures at mid-morning we're already around 66 in Montgomery and 68 in Dothan and 70 in Birmingham it is a really nice day I'm going to widen out the view and show you what's going on now you see this storm system out to the west of us now normally if you see a storm system that close you know that it's going to be what uh, a few hours away maybe a day or two away but in not in this case. Uh, what, what's, what's happening is we have a big bubble of high pressure which is kind of supporting us and keeping the storm systems away from us. So that storm system in the middle of the country is not going to be affecting us for the next day or two or three. As a matter of fact, it'll be uh, towards Thursday night into Friday before we have the next uh, storm system affecting us. What a weekend they had out in the Rockies too. Uh, Denver's recovering now, but they had some very heavy snow there this uh, that last weekend. Temperatures are warm out ahead of this thing and uh, we're, I'm going to show you what's going on here as far as um, our weather goes. First of all, sunny and warmer today with a high temperature up to about 80. Tonight's low down to about 50 and easterly winds not as strong as they have been out of the uh, east at 6 to 12 miles per hour. Now here's what's going on at 20,000 feet. The upper level ridge of high pressure is swelling up over uh, the, um, the Gulf South and the southeastern U.S. and that's keeping that big storm system out to the west. You see those concentric circles. That's keeping that at bay. Well, the bubble will burst later in the week, but not right away. And I think by Thursday, a piece of energy will be coming our way. And by Thursday evening, scattered showers and thunderstorms are back in the picture. I don't think right now it doesn't look to me like a severe weather situation. We'll continue to keep an eye on that. I'll have another update for you on that, that scenario uh, tomorrow morning on your morning video here. So we're looking for e an even warmer day tomorrow with a high in the lower 80s and lower 80s on Wednesday with uh, increasing humidity, south winds taking over. Then on Thursday, with a high around 80. I think much of the day will be dry with a 30% chance of thunderstorms by the afternoon. A better chance of scattered showers and thunderstorms Thursday night into at least part of the day Friday before that system gets out of here. 78 is your high on Friday. Saturday, the start of a good weekend. Looks like 83 degrees and uh, I think even pro probably lower 80s on Sunday as well. Uh, the European out 10 days is showing that one storm system. You see the blue bar bar bars on the bottom there? Uh, as we get into late Thursday, Thursday night into Friday, that's that next storm system coming in. Meanwhile, much of the 10-day the period will be relatively dry and storm-free. And this is the GFS temperatures out 16 days. Don't take the actual numbers um, uh, verbatim. Uh, just take a look at trends. And the trend is a very warm period of time. This goes into the early part of May till around May the 3rd. So that's the situation there. So there you go. That is your update from the uh, Weather Center this morning. I hope you have a great day today. Your next complete morning video will be online. Usually they're online by about 445 in the morning. Have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Rich Thomas Weather.